This morning, Mothers Against Drunk Driving is continuing their mission of putting an end to drunk driving here in San Antonio and saving lives. Families and friends are gathering right now to remember loved ones killed by a drunk driver at the 2024 Walk Like Mad, again happening right now at Palo Alto College on our city's south side. And that's where we find Ken Spies anchor Vanessa Croy, who was emceeing the walk this morning. I saw you, girl. You were busy. Yes, there are so many people out here today, not only coming to honor their lost loved ones, but to fight for change because the rally cry out here today is no more victims. I first want to give a shout out to the music you're hearing behind us. That is Eisenhower Middle School Band. And we want to give you a live look at the walk just kicked off a few minutes ago. Many people walking with uh, pictures, with uh, remembrances of their loved ones that were lost to a drunk driver. We also spoke with uh, Deputy Meredith Portillo's family. She was killed in July by a wrong way driver on a San Antonio freeway. We also heard from Chief McManus this morning that at least two lives were lost last night on San Antonio roads to a drunk driver. And that's why everyone is gathered out here today, not only to walk in support of these victims' families, but demand change going forward. Now, Sarah, before we go, I want to say that so far, Mothers Against Drunk Driving has raised $50,000 here at this walk today, but still they are hoping to raise another 15,000 and you can donate until the end of December. We're going to get out of the way and let the rest of our walkers here uh, finish their walk. And once again, just go to madsanantonio.org if you'd like to make a donation. Once again, not only to support these families, but to make San Antonio roads safer. Sarah, we are live at Palo Alto College and we're going to send it back to you. Such an important cause, Maggie. So Yes, absolutely. Thank you so much, Vanessa, for that report.